So we're here in SoCal for the Thanksgiving holiday weekend. We're going to Universal today, but I did make a stop here at Diamond 9. So let's take a look and see if there's a lot of people here. I know there's no other sports car shows this weekend because so I've tried to look for them. Um, so we're going to stop by, see if we can pick any nice cool grabs. I don't know how pop it's going to be, but uh, let's take a look. Like I said, I always make an effort to stop by this sports car show whenever I'm in the area. back from LA a very quick trip and we'll just go over the card show the diamond nine sports card show was the only show that was happening in LA over Thanksgiving weekend so there were significantly more vendors or people trying to sell stuff at the card show than there normally was um, I've been there on other days where there's uh, other shows in the area and there's I'd say about one third amount of people there so I was super happy to see that when there are no other shows that the community is actually really big and that people are really utilizing that store like I said whenever we're in that area I try to make an effort on Saturdays to go see the Diamond Nine Sports Show so if you guys live in that area or visiting or passing by I definitely recommend it uh, we didn't do that much of buying I actually spent a lot of time talking to vendors it was really nice to talk to the community there what i've noticed after talking to a lot of people is that they actually recognize me and my wife uh, from our videos because we do come often to the la shows because of the youtube algorithm they see us on the videos really happy um and, and glad that you know i'm able to meet you guys in person and talk to you guys so if you guys ever do see us feel free to you know to stop us and say hi because it'd be really great to meet you guys i was talking to one of the vendors uh, i'll give a shout out to their instagram john v and he works with a group of people which is fomo collectibles shout out to them i closed a deal with them and i got this 2021 select silver prism tyrese halliburton for five dollars and then i also picked up a bunch of one dollar cards and then lastly i picked up two jordan pool rookie cards for five dollars total I think the select was $4 and then the holiday card was like a dollar. So only spent $15 to show. I didn't spend too much time there. I didn't make sure to see every single vendor. Not very much Pokemon. So you guys will kind of notice over time that we do vastly majority of Pokemon with this channel. It's just that you guys happen to see me because of the sports card shows that I go to looking for those Pokemon cards. But I do do dabble in sports cards. Just don't buy too much. Uh, if you guys are looking for sports cards like YouTubers who are super enthusiastic about the sports, you know, who to invest in and who to buy up, I definitely would recommend other YouTubers. But for me, I just dabble in sports. I think it's really cool to pick up, you know, cool players and I do with little very low end stuff. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video of me stopping by LA to see the Diamond Nine Sports Card Show. As always, until next time, guys, stay safe, stay healthy, and we'll see you all in the next video.